What is up guys, Tomody here. As you can see, today it's snowing. <laughs> uh, just a little update, so like, just to keep you going that I'm still active. Cause, sorry it's been a while because a few issues have been going on in life, work and all sorts. So as of today, I am just on my way to band practice. Yeah, I gotta get that I gotta get my gotta get my car fixed as well, unfortunately. Saying these things that last forever. That's not my car, that's my neighbours. We're let, we're allowing him to park on our drive because otherwise he's on the mud. Uh, so the worst is yet to come unfortunately. <laughs> Guess that's better. So just before I give you a heads up, I'm gonna get back into gaming soon because I've just I've just purchased some games which should be of interest to you guys. One's about one's called the President. Basically, it's all about saving the president and sorry, protecting the president. Uh, there's also other games. Unfortunately, the bad news is for a while I won't be able to do any garage mod, any more garage mod because for some reason there's a restrict me glitch going on, preventing me from doing anything on it. So I'm afraid until further notice, there's no more garage mod. But <coughs> I can tell you now. That things just don't. I just don't know what's going on, really. I mean, it's almost like you know, at first it was texture. Sorry, at first it was text a texture issue, but now it's a it's a completely another issue. Ah, uh, one sec, gotta move this a bit. I stalled. bloody cars parked everywhere. It's like I'm going through an obstacle course. I mean, if you look around. You see what I mean? There's cars everywhere. <sighs> right. Let's get going. So yeah. I go to the, I go to band practice on my days off around five o'clock every every evening. We just play for two hours, we play for three hours up to two to three hours, uh, learning a new cover, keeping ourselves rusty, or even, better yet, creating a new song, if we can. And <coughs> amazing, amazing message is that, uh, sorry, oh, I, I usually don't do this stuff because I've I become unprepared. Uh, Normally, you know, normally I don't do vlogs, but the reason I do vlogs is because I'm just uh, I'm trying to keep myself updated and I'm trying to not bore you guys thinking I've gone. Because I'm not gone yet. I mean, I'm not, di I'm not dying without a good fight. <clears throat> Fortunately, things are now going to get harder. Tractor. <laughs> Tractors always slow down the road. Yep, I drive about 26... Sorry, I drive over 28 miles per day each way. So, 20 mile, 28 miles there and 20 miles back to work. So that's a lot of fuel, unfortunately, and it's a long way to go, I know, but it's how you're gonna make ends meet, that's the problem. And not to mention, I've actually sacrificed my evenings. I'm working like half one till 10 almost every night. That means, you know, I can't do much at night. Especially when I'm still over my parents and I'm trying to keep them quiet. But that's just life. Until, you see, I'm going to get myself my very own house. So therefore, I'll be able to make more videos and interest you guys. I'll be able to do a lot more once I get my own house. Plus, it'll make my life easier. I mean, it'll be expensive, but... I know it's going to be worth it, and not to mention it's going to take a while because I've got to get this car sorted, which is going to cost me almost a thousand quid in total. 
well, a little less than a thousand, but so much, you know, it's going to set you back several days. I mean, I tell you, driving has probably been one of the best things in my life. I mean, when I first passed my driving test, it was one of the most happiest days of my life. And ever since then, I've been very help. you know, it's been very helpful for me, my family, and a few friends of mine. I mean, it made my life much easier. It took long, but it was worth it. It was definitely worth it. As of now, I am leaving, I'm leaving Patrington, and I'm heading towards Hull. And then past there, I'll be passing towards Gilberdike, where, sorry, and then, then I'll be heading to Gilberdike, where, where, we, where we practice. We practice in the farm shed, as you've seen in my other videos, where we practice, obviously. What it's like, anyway. <coughs> so, yeah, it's a long drive. I do this every day. I drive so far, I have to keep driving so far every day, which is kind of an interesting thing, and not... It's kind of a nuisance, you know, so much fuel is wasted, all sorts, but it's what I do for a living, drive. Plus, I like to do this trick here. I'm driving with my, with my knees. Cool, isn't it? Yeah, I'm just driving with my knees. So. This is actually cheeky, but as long as I don't do it too long. I mean, <laughs> anyway, uh, oh, is there anything else to say? What I also plan to do in about a month's time or so is I'm going to take a trip down to the, uh, I'm going to take a trip down south to the Isle of Wight and do another travel vlog, obviously. And of course, you know, my granddad lives near there, so I'm going to be able to see him too. It'll be a nice little holiday. And I'm hoping to bring someone with me. Don't know who yet, but hopefully. Who knows? Maybe it's you. Well, but yeah, in other ways, you're all coming too. I mean, maybe one of you coming with me personally, but all of you are coming with me on that journey through this video. So look at you. Anyway, I think that's all the time I've got for. I must get going, and I'll see you guys later.